Hi everybody from a beautiful day in Skyrim, or more particularly Solstheim. Uh, we're looking at Serethi Manor, Mansion and Village today by T Warrior, last updated in 2021. Comes with a quest. Uh, this is the ship that normally brings you to Solstheim. That's the one that will take you to the new village, which is extremely cool. And there's a lot of cool features about this mod. The quest was fun. I got my sword bloody. A um, bit of toing and froing, nothing exciting. I won't spoil it for you, but you know, it was all right, it was fun. And then you end up coming here. By the way, um, because there's no quest marker, when it comes to the part in the quest where it tells you to get the property transferred to you, go and see Mayor Morvane here in Solstein, uh, in Raven Rock. Okay. So here we are at the village comes with all sorts of features this place yes it's very nice and there's a fisherman mr salt fingers <laughs> all these little cottages i won't go into all of them hedowit strong plank that's a name to conjure with look at this place though it's pretty fantastic isn't it and it goes on Wow. There's a trading house here. The whole point really is to get to your house, but you know. Glover Mallory is a wonder with a hammer and anvil. He mended my armor like an old pro. Okay, thanks. Sorry, should have turned the voices off. <laughs> but it feels like a lively village, doesn't it? So this place, that's the trading hub. Let me show you what the guy's got for sale. Oh wait, he's down here. Oh, hello. Mr. Baker. Hmm? Hmm? Take a look. Will do. Okay, so in his miscellaneous section, he's got Eastern gems. I don't know if that comes with this mod or something else, but uh, interesting. Clothes, weapons, books, all sorts. Good day. Good day, thank you. Need something? I do. I can't even pronounce your name. <laughs> So I'm not going to try. Little fish stall. Village well. Chickens bobbing about. Smithy over there. Looks like the smith. Riskar Corundum gut. <laughs> Brilliant. There's also a mine here with miners. And warriors. dragons and homes and oh all sorts anywho let's have a look at your house okay so the house is quite large comes with this guy who is a follower Azura's wisdom to you friend and you get these mannequins that one's got a warm coat on it that one's got temple robes as far as I can tell there are no secret passageways or anything yes, like that there here there are a couple of other Members of staff, this lady. Do you see shrines, wardrobes, bookcases? Um, <laughs> uh, dining area? Nice. Drinks, library. Storage. And then a workroom. Staff Enchanter, Arcane Enchanter, Alchemy, plenty of storage, somewhere to store your bug jars. Check out the mod page because it does tell you what you can store here. You can put your black books and Elder Scrolls there and there are also skill books. Very nice. Wood chopping block. And then Armory next door. Fair few weapon racks, plaques, display cases. A few more mannequins. Kind of cosy. All the bedrooms are on the uh, floor below this one. This is kind of the living floor. Could do without the cobwebs. <laughs> I guess this is your housekeeper's room. It's certainly an owned bed anyway. Then the kitchen area with your chef. Oh, is this our dude? Yes, it is. Look at that. Oh, oh he of the unpronounceable name. 
Okay. Brewing area. Yeah. If this is your bag, this kind of property, then I think you'll enjoy it. Like I say, it's quite large, but it's not overly large, you know? This is a, quite a compact floor down here. There's room for two kids, a couple of wardrobes, a couple of cute little beds. This dude, domesticated Durzog, that's what he is. I guess this is a Morrowind reference. I, I never played Morrowind, I'm sorry. My first Elder Scrolls game was Oblivion. And then over on the other side, your bedroom. Quite simple, isn't it? Quite simply decorated. A little desk, some wardrobes. Comfy bed. And then probably my favourite room, if not the crafting room, which I very much enjoy, is this, which is your bathroom. The tapestries are very lovely. So there's a stone bed. It's kind of like, um, like a little sauna area, this bit, you know? And then a pool. Nice. Very nice, actually. All right. I'm going to leave it here. Call that the end of this wee video. Say thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon for the next one. Take care and stay safe, everybody.